I missed the first two days for Playlist Live. I'm only in school for the first three periods. I don't even know why I'm supposed to be going. Well, I read a good like 150 pages today. I just don't enjoy it. I'd rather do online school, but that's how it's gonna be this year. Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today is my first day of senior year. I missed the first two days for Playlist Live. It was it was worth it, okay? Doesn't matter. But we also had a college tour. Now I have to go back to school. I haven't been back in school for two and a half years. I did online school for the second half of my freshman year, all of my sophomore and all of my junior year. So I'm a senior going back to school and I don't know what to think about it. Like I don't I don't want to go back. I really love online school, but my mom wants me to get like the high school experience and have a real like in-person school on my transcript. It is so different than what I expected the start of my senior year to look like. Like it's infinitely different from what me like five years ago would have thought. I guess that's what COVID did to us. I have to leave pretty soon. My mom is driving me in because I do not have a parking pass yet. Everything's a mess with my rain rolling. I can only get three in-person classes, which is just terrible. <laughs> like, I'm only in school for the first three periods, and I don't even know what classes I get to go to for that because I can't sign into power school, I can't get into my email, like, it's just terrible. We're not on the emailing list, so it's been a real mess. So I need to try to get something sorted out this morning before I go to class and meet my teachers, and then also I have to do a bunch of online classes still, and of course it's like the dreariest day outside too, it's been raining. All day yesterday, all day today. So yeah, back to school, I guess. Here's my outfit. I'm just wearing this stripey top and then jeans cause it's like 60 out, even though, you know, it's still like summer, I wish. I'm also gonna wear a raincoat, of course, because it's like nasty out and I'll probably be cold. We're on our way. So first thing I have to do is Go in the office and pick up my parking pass. Then I have to go over to Guidance and I have a lot of things to do there. I need to talk to somebody about my schedule because I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going. And what else? I have some forms to give in about my online classes and the fact that I'm only taking three classes from the school. And what else? My email doesn't work and my power school doesn't work so hopefully somebody can help me with that too yeah I wish we could have gotten this resolved beforehand but <laughs> nope it didn't happen so I made it I it's 10 I'm done with school so basically every day it's gonna be like 7 30 to 10 and on Mondays and Fridays it's like 10 20 and 10 30 so it's not too long I guess I might have to stay for like days that have events you know, like, school-wide events. I don't know how it uh, come back or something. I don't really know how that works. But I got my parking pass, so I'll be able to use that tomorrow. I got homework, yay. I have to work on reading a book for AP Lit that I was not able to finish, so I could not participate in my class discussion today. So the classes I'm taking, well, I'm currently enrolled in AP Lit and Latin 1. So those are two that I went to today. And then I will be in physics, hopefully. They just have, I don't know why they can't just give me one more desk in the room. Like, how does that hurt them to have one more student? So still trying to figure out physics. And then I have to take AP Stat online and Honor Spanish 4 online also because I want to continue with the online curriculum. And I'm also taking, I have to finish up forensic science and government online so it's kind of a lot of online and i still have to go to school in the morning no i did not get my chromebook i didn't have a chance to before class started the library wasn't open so i didn't get to do that so that's one thing left for tomorrow and i told my teachers that i can't get onto google classroom or power school or i can't even like email them or anything so that's a pain <laughs> but yeah trying to figure that out. Hopefully we can get that done within the next few days. But yeah, I guess I will like check back with you guys once I get started with more of my online work. I have to enroll in my two online classes that 
I haven't started yet and well I haven't been approved for them but I'm starting them anyway. <laughs> yeah that's kind of it. Just reading today. We're going to the library now. I should not get any books. Maybe I'll get like one book if I really want it. But yeah, then we'll go home. I made it home. The first thing I'm going to do is change out of my outfit. Like, it was fine for school, but I want to be in something comfortable. Today is mainly just a online work day and I have to do a bunch of reading for my AP Lit class. So I'd hopefully like to finish A Thousand Splendid Sons by Thursday or Friday this week and it's Tuesday. Kind of have a lot to do. I'm like 50 pages in. It shouldn't be such a big deal, but I do want to get it done so I can actually participate in class. That's one of the things I need to do. I need to work on sorting out my email and power school stuff and I need to get a video up tonight. But I'm kind of glad it's raining out because I'm going to be all cozy on the couch reading and doing my schoolwork instead of like it being beautiful out and me still having to do my schoolwork. So yeah, I'm gonna go get changed and then I think I'm gonna make a snack. It is quite a bit later now, but I spent most of the day reading that book. This book, I am almost halfway through it, so I read a good like 150 pages today, which is pretty good. I, it was like a couple hours, I think. I wasn't like super focused the entire time, but it was fine. What else did I do since then? I had dinner with my family. Um, I did a little work and I uploaded a video and I did some extra schoolwork, some online stuff, and also we worked on sorting out some stuff for um, my in-person school. We got my power school login, which no thanks to the school. My mom had to dig through our past like records and she did end up finding my login, which was great, but it was kind of a mess trying to get everything sorted out, but I have kind of a long list of things that I have to do tomorrow to get sorted out at school such as getting into my physics class that I haven't been accepted into yet because they have like a full class and they can't fit one more apparently. I don't know. Hopefully that can get figured out because if not, I will only have one class in person tomorrow, which would be really weird. I feel like I have a lot to do tomorrow, but I'm glad I got the first day out of the way. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along. It is definitely a very non-traditional year for me. I hope I can get everything figured out, but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing how this year is going to go for me. That's just going to be very different. I am going to interrupt you guys. I'm sorry. I know you thought it was the end of the video. It's not. I want to give you a little update about how school has been going. It is a week later, so I've been in school for a week, and things have changed a little bit. So you know how I thought I was going to get into physics. I kept hinting that I wasn't going to get into physics as you've seen with the editing. No, I did not get into physics. So the ad drop period ended yesterday. So I got into AP Environmental Science on Friday. I literally had two classes for me to be able to decide whether I was going to keep the class. So I just had to keep it basically. My schedule looks like Mondays and Fridays, I have AP Lit, Latin, and AP Environmental Science. Then Tuesday, I have AP Lit in Latin. Wednesday, I have Latin and AP Environmental Science. Thursday, I have AP Lit and AP Environmental Science. And then I already went over Friday. I am only in school, like I said, until 10 or 10.30 each day, which I'm glad I got a third class because I would have been going in for literally one period. So I would have been in the school for one hour and then have driven 10 minutes each way to get there, so that didn't sound fun to me. So I will be taking AP Stat online and Spanish 4. Like I said, I'm still in forensic science and government, so 
It's going to be a lot. It has been a lot and I'm not even in those two extra online classes yet. I'm hoping it works out. Like I said, it's not a traditional senior year. I also want to give a little more background on like how I'm in this school, how I know people and everything. So I went to the same school from kindergarten, I mean the same school district, from kindergarten up until ninth grade through COVID. So after ninth grade, I switched and did online school for two years. So I'm going back. I know all of the people already. I don't really know the teachers because kind of over COVID, they all changed. So I don't know that many of the teachers, but I'm perfectly comfortable being there. I just, I just don't enjoy it. I'd rather do online school, but that's how it's going to be this year. So yeah, I've been really, really busy since this video was filmed. Just college things, which... It's gonna be a whole series, my applying to colleges. I'm going to be visiting a bunch more again that I've already brought you guys to, so be ready for that. But yeah, let's go to the outro. Make sure to follow me on all social media at Rosie Revolts. Check out my Etsy shop, also at Rosie Revolts, and my book at getoutdoorsbook.com, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!